In D.C., House Republicans are making good on their promise to target Manhattan D.A. Alvin Bragg, starting by issuing a subpoena to one of his ex-prosecutors. NBC Sahil Kapoor is on Capitol Hill. What's this all about? Hey, Chris. Well, this is the first subpoena of the Republican investigation into the Trump investigators. This one goes out to Mark Pomeranz from Judiciary Chairman Jim Jordan, who's being uh, who's telling him to sit for a deposition before the committee. So who is Mark Pomeranz? He's a former uh, special assistant DA in the Manhattan DA's office starting in uh, 2021 when he helped lead the Trump investigation. Fast forward to early 2022, newly minted DA Alvin Bragg is sworn in. He looks unlikely to charge Trump. Pomerantz resigns, says that move is wrong and misguided. He insists that Trump was guilty of numerous felony violations. Then he writes a book about it and takes it on the road. Now Jim Jordan is saying that Pomerantz is uniquely situated to provide information uh, into that Republican investigation. So what does Jim Jordan want here? His motives are not very difficult to decipher. Jordan sees Pomerantz as a key witness to bolstering his claim that this is the politically motivated indictment, which is a claim that Jordan was making well before the indictment even landed. A Jordan says in his letter, and I'll quote part of it, quote, your public resignation reportedly left D.A. Bragg deeply stung. He goes on to say, your book also contributed to the political pressure D.A. Bragg felt to bring charges against former President Trump. NBC has reached out to Pomerantz's firm and to the top Democrat on the Judiciary Committee. Chris, we have not heard back.